hello everyone and welcome to well a slightly different video from me and another vlog style video you can see just there we are at the coast here in Panath about to get on the PS Waverley for a trip out there in the Bristol Channel so I definitely got my sea legs on we will be visiting Clevedon, Minehead and Ilfracombe and hopefully having some time ashore at Ilfracombe as well which would be nice. So hopefully uh, it will be a beautiful day as you can see the weather is really good here in South Wales which is always nice and hopefully we don't get seasick that wouldn't be good would it. So please come and join me on a trip on the PS Waverley in the Bristol Channel. If we just spin the camera around we can see there is the pier, we might just be able to spot the ship at the end. So come aboard for a trip to Ilfracombe on the Waverley. And here we go then, let's start our journey across the Bristol Channel for our first stop of Clevedon.
And here we go, this is our first stop on our cruise today. We just arrived in at Clevedon Pier to pick up some more passengers before continuing our journey down to Ilford.
And here we are guys, just as you can see arriving into Ilfracoom Harbour. We will be having two hours ashore here to explore Ilfracoom and I'll show you some of the sights and sceneries while uh, on shore here before rejoining the Waverley for the return trip. It's a little bit rocky coming in here isn't it? <laughs> Well, just had a short walk from the ship up, up here. Quite a climb, but so worth it. The scenery in this part of the world is just fantastic, isn't it? Especially when the sun's out. Ah, look. There is the Waverley there, waiting to take us back in an hour or so time, but what a lovely place Ilfracoom is. Here is a bit more of this incredible scenery here at Ilfracoom. Walked up the coastal path just through the main town centre and this is what I was greeted with. Gosh, if the, you could guarantee the weather in this country, we really would need to go abroad. Just crystal blue water, the sun is out. Can't really get much better. You might just be able to spot Waverley. Just zoom in there for you. Might just be able to see its iconic funnels just there. That's where I just was, where that chapel is up on the mountain just there. And here is the actual town of Ilfracoom, which I think is about time I got an ice cream. Can't come to Devon and not have an ice cream on a sunny day, can you? So I hope you're enjoying uh, today's vlog style of video. If you want me to do more like this, I certainly will do so as the months and years go on. But yeah, really good. So what we're going to do now, I'm going to go back down and wait to board Waverley and on the return trip we'll be going via Minehead and Clevedon before returning to Panath about quarter to eight, if everything goes on time that is. So let's get back on board Waverley.
Here we are then, just arriving at Minehead, one of the last stops on our journey today, just to drop off some passengers before we continue the last leg back to Panath this evening. Here I am then back where I started quite a long time ago uh, here at Panath Pier. Absolutely amazing day. Some surprises, including a submarine. Who would have thought we would see one of those by travelling on Waverley? But again, they've done a great job and really done a nice cruise today. And if you ever have a chance to travel on the Waverley anywhere in the UK, you really should take it. It's well worth. So I'm going to leave you now with the shots of the Waverley leaving Panath. Thank you very much for watching. I'll be back with loads more content for you very soon. Bye everyone.